This is a short tutorial on the process of polymerization. Polymers are very large molecules made when hundreds of monomers join together to form long chains. For many polymers, the monomer that they are form, formed from is an alkene. Alkenes contain at least one double covalent bond between carbon atoms. The double bond makes them very reactive. In this example, ethene is going to be our alkene. The white balls will represent hydrogen atoms and the brown balls, carbon atoms. This is ethene. It has four hydrogen atoms and two carbon atoms join together with a double covalent bond. This molecule is a monomer. When monomers react, one of the carbon-carbon bonds breaks and joins with its neighbouring molecule. The resulting molecule is a polymer, like this. When polyethene is made, thousands of ethene molecules join together like this to form a long chain. This example shows three repeat units of ethene. This is, this is because there are three sets of ethene. In an exam, however, you would not draw this. You would draw the shorthand method of showing polyethene, like this. The N means that the polymer contains a very large number of the repeating units shown in the brackets. In today's, in today's world, polyethene, or polythene, is used to make plastic bags.